everybody how's it going welcome back to the channel it's your boy paul rotto and we're back at it for another video so today we are hopping in because yesterday we was playing one piece fighting path and i had a lot of what is this game how did i get it um, what do i do to do it if i want to try it out and i'm here today to solve all those questions based off of my experience on getting the game First, if you guys are new here to the channel, make sure to go down, hit that subscribe button if you guys are enjoying the One Piece Dragon Ball Z game content here on the channel. Second, if you guys are uh, liking this and want to share this with everybody, then make sure to go down, hit that like button to spread the word of what was going down there. There's also a second admin note with this. So, I, I personally did watch a couple guides and experimented with a few different ways until I found a working recipe that worked with my setup. So there is, in this, I'm gonna have the Chinese IDs that you're gonna need to use to be able to continue on in the game. But I am gonna link um, OP Society and the Chinese ID list that I used that was found on his channel. And I'm going to link Tag the Legends channel down there below because your boy helped your boy helped me out just a little bit. I, I was on the right path with the emulator, had it all done. There was just some kinks, so he put me on game on the one that he was using, and things worked out smoother. So I just feel like it, it's due credit to show where I got the working emulator from. But this is going to be on a PC slash Android setup, iOS. I I can help you. I can help you walk through it at some point later on if you have any questions I personally wasn't able to do it so I don't want to say these are the steps to do so and it not work out for you so unfortunately I can, I can tell you what to do I just can't verify that it works because it didn't work for me so the first thing you are going to want to do is emulator I downloaded was Knox player and that worked for me it worked with the game there was no issues with it the only issue I had is when it came time to translate and there was a lot of translation issues whenever the app was trying to work and I'll get to this point in a little bit and within this video you're going to be able to get the Chinese IDs, how to download it without using TikTok and everything. So that that's where I was stuck at. But, well that was the second part I was stuck at. The first part I was stuck at was how do I get this freaking game and how do I uh get to log in so that way i'm able to play because i was stuck at the home screen at for this game for a while okay so i was stuck at this screen minus having this here it was just um just this text waiting to log in and i was unable to log in and it just kept bringing me to like this login prompt that i couldn't do anything with and i'll try to have a picture of it somewhere um just to see if i that'll work better but I was at this page and I couldn't get past the home page for the longest. After trying a few other methods, trying to brute force TikTok um, authentication through the emulator, which uh, after some reading, it said that TikTok, the Ch at least the Chinese one, picks up on if you're using a emulator, it will not allow you to log in if you're using it. So especially if you're going to use your PC to emulate this, I highly suggest using this method. So what you're going to do is on your device, you're going to open up the browser, whatever internet browser that you do use. Okay, so you want to click on this second one down here is the one that I used. Um, so you're going to click on that one. It's going to bring you to this site right here that has a whole lot of games. Um, and then as you can see right here, one Piece Fighting Path, this is the gaming logo for it, but we're gonna verify that that's the game by coming up here and simply we are just gonna type One Piece Fighting Path and hit enter and boom, comes up. So right here as you can see the game is 1.59 gigs that is what you want to look at because that's how you're going to verify what it is this green button off to the side is the install button so what's going to happen is you're going to click this 
and it's going to start downloading up top and what it's actually doing is downloading the 4399 player this one onto your uh, Android emulated device or your Android device so you can do this on Android as well and once that's done then it's actually going to start the install for the game itself afterwards which is very important to note and it's gonna come up here and then it's gonna have like a blue bar and it's gonna download it it's gonna take a little bit of time maybe it took me about um, 20 or 30 minutes to download it and that's just because of the connection I'm on so if it's um, if you have a better connection than where I'm at then it might take a shorter amount of time but that's roughly how long it took me to download the game after you download the game you're gonna hop into here you're gonna do the ace tutorial where it takes you through the marine forward fight and then you're gonna get to this screen um, right here and then when you try to log in what's gonna happen is it's gonna take you to a login page for four three the four three nine nine player like I said I, I have all this installed so I can't really go back to do it um, but it's gonna take you to a login page on there and what you're gonna do is you're gonna hit the right button and it's gonna be in black text and you're gonna create and then the next two lines you're gonna create an account right and after you do that it's gonna there's no email verification it's gonna bring you to this page uh, you're gonna check the terms and conditions right here and then hit this button and then it's gonna bring up the prompt for a Chinese ID and then you're gonna use the link that's in the description to take you to that Chinese ID uh, list and what I highly advise is that um, not like the very bottom but what I would say is shoot for like number 1500 and less because a lot of people are lazy so a lot of people are going to use the ones on the first front page and, that, and that's not going to allow you to go through that's exactly what happened to me so what I did was I scrolled to the bottom grabbed one off the uh, after like I cleared a thousand and I had no problems when I loaded in after that you'll get to back to the screen and you'll click the button and it'll let you in once you get here you're loaded up into the game and you're good to go now what I was saying earlier with the translation app I was using is you want to go to the Play Store either on your emulated device or the actual Android device and you want to download tap to translate and this thing is godsend so what's gonna happen is the from is you want to do Chinese simplified or Chinese traditional it has both options for both and then what you want to do let's see if I can get it on here is the way I got it to work on the emulated device was I needed to check this little blue button instead of the red one and you just click once and it translates everything for you right here boom sailing cold knowledge and it's all gonna be rough transitions so that's one thing you're gonna have to keep in mind all eventual like this is the text box that was on here before all adventure levels have three star conditions and achievement conditions you can get additional rewards for when you achieve it and then i believe if you just click one more time it's supposed to stop it okay look perfect nami so we'll click on the box right or click on the target that's all you gotta do is click once and there you go it takes a second so just be patient with it and here it goes my goal is to make 100 million berry then buy a certain village and then unfortunately you're gonna have to do this every time if you want to read the dialogue on the game it, it's it's something that helps a lot and mainly if anything you want to do this with the guides more so than doing this with the dialogue especially like with me i'm fairly versed on the one piece story so i roughly remember everything that's going on with it so i'm not necessarily too worried about the dialogue i'm more worried about this so that way i can see 
what's going on with all my stuff and where I need to go and what the game is trying to tell me that I need to get done. That is going to wrap up this video. If you guys enjoyed the guide and thought this was useful, make sure to go down and hit that uh, like button down below. Make it blue. As well as if you're looking forward to more fighting piece or fighting One Piece fighting path content, then make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. We are going to be bringing this live and direct. Um, for right now, it's going to be a live only series minus this video, but I definitely had a lot of fun with this. An hour and some change flew by while streaming and I didn't even notice. So we are definitely going to have a lot of fun with this. But like I said, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to like, like the video. If you guys are enjoying the content, make sure to hit that subscribe button and we're out of here. See you guys. Going up.